Hello, I'm Entrilisium, and welcome to Rogue State Revolution, where our lovely little country of Basenji is doing okay. Like, our prosperity is decent, our healthcare is bearable, our public safety is fine, our environmental... You know what? Okay, we're, we're doing fine. Okay. Middle of the road. And I will take that. That is acceptable. So, this is a sponsored video. It's sponsored by Modern Wolf. And uh, there'll be a link down below in the description. If you do want to go check out the game on Steam, you can do so. There is also a free demo if you want to go check that out. And then uh, see if you like the game or not. So, when that's said and done, Basenji is going to carry on into the future. Veterans who served in the revolution and the civil war are unhappy with the meager benefits. Um, I don't want to lose loyalty. I'll spend the money. We've got money. We'll commit additional funds. I've only got two military units, but whatever. Uh, you're happy that we've been sending you the extra food we talked about? Great. Okay. Um, you want me to increase approval by 2% in Saba. The seven months remaining will probably be fine. I think we can probably leave them to it for now. Meanwhile, intelligence officer, there is a base over here. So let's get people moving. And we don't want them to strike. So I'm actually going to spend some points double moving. Right. In the meantime, food situation is okay. It could be better, but is okay. Plastic factories running pretty much full. Smelters running pretty much full. Uh, yeah, the gold smelter isn't. Everything else is kind of almost at max. So we might have considered just kind of making extra room for that. Yeah, we've got box that deposit here. You know what? Let's take advantage of this. So mine... Obviously, then build a road to it. Um, increase uh, pollution at the site. 20% increase in production. It's only 20% increase in production. So, nah. We'll build a new one. And we won't build it near the border, just in case we do get attacked. I'd rather have everything a little bit more central. Unstable, unstable. Ooh, oh dear. Okay. Well, whatever. But one move left. Can't hire anyone for four months. Let's switch to focusing on maybe like climate change. That hopefully will allow us to like get some interest in Washington going. Water treatment plants in Ramai experience cancer failures. Many citizens will be ill from consuming water contaminated. Um, suppress any reporting. We get less health access. Share everything with the public and declare a health emergency. Minus 5 approval or blame us on an act of terrorism. Possible minus 10% approval. Certainly plus 1 loyalty. I mean, we don't need the loyalty. I'm going to take the hit in Ramai. It's only in Ramai. Uh, you would like us to consider the welfare of conservative citizens. I'm going to disagree. I'm sorry it's going to hit the relations a bit, but it's not worth trying to do that. We did do it recently and up relations with conservative citizens. I don't think we can do it again. Let's see what you want. Join the Maritime Accord. Yes, conservatives will hate this, but it gets us so much other stuff like international diplomacy, climate leadership, legal immigrant approval, liberal approval. Museum exchanges, education and diplomacy, yes. And then... Ah, we need a climate leadership of greater than six. How are we doing on that? Oh, it's only three still. Ugh. Okay. Intel officer. Get moving. Okay, I guess we double move. 
There we go. And it's right next to the bollock point. Yeah, that's not good. Uh, armor. Double move. Okay, we should have that next turn, I hope. Just in case we need backup, I will move the Sams closer. we put another hospital in here? No, not really. Okay, what about market? What do we got on here? On per town. There we go. I know. We'll build another one as well. Uh, where is it? Market. There we go. Oh, yeah. More prosperity for everyone. Well, specifically the people who are getting markets, I guess. Uh, in addition, we did get ourselves a religious building last time. So let's get a cleric. Excellency. Now, clerics go to holy places and then have revelations and stuff. So let's just get you moving. Just expedite movement so you're there. Oh, it happened. Great. Uh, you want a stadium in Karak. Um, I'm going to train infantry because, again, infantry are cheap. So using them to replace this will be fine. And we will double move you. Boom. Excellency. Excellency. I'm going to move the Sams back. Excellency. We'll get you coming this way. I don't want to waste the armor by taking that with them. And then you need a stadium in... Karak. Okay, construct. Stadium. Not a problem. Oh, we got a cleric. Excellency. Okay. A cleric meets with an old companion who has since become a very successful businessman. The companion is deeply depressed in spite of his wealth and power. Once you have enough money to meet your basic needs, everything on top of that just puts us on a treadmill where we want more and more. As we get wealthier, we become more isolated. We don't need people the way we did when we were poor. The cleric asks why, with such misery, his friend doesn't give away his wealth. It is a curse. The only thing worse than the misery this money has brought me is the crippling fear that without it, I would be unhappier still. The cleric considers the great joy seen in so many people who have much less. Inspired by the conversation, the cleric adopts the Edict of Piety. Excellency. And we have ecological impact surveys. Nice. That ups the environment. Great. Let's do it. And then... Let's learn about the carbon market. You know what? Why don't we just sort this out right now? It costs us the... Uh, tank, but I think it's worth it. We can just train a new tank right now. Probably worth it for the trade. Zarbil will prove powerful ally if we improve our relationship with them. Okay. I mean... That's going to be tough. Alright, what's our problem here? We're only getting in 40 gold bars. We need more. I don't think there's much we can do about that. 
Hi, I need more gold bars. You won't give me any more. Give me more gold ore. You won't give me any more. Okay. Will anyone give me gold? Like, that's the issue right now. We have no way of getting any more gold. Uh, could we just import consumer electronics? Yes. Address the nation. Let's talk about security threats. We'll be presidential. Again, they ignore us. Conservatives are the only people who really care. We could do secret projects. I want to do secret projects. I think we'll do that after we start working on, like, the seaport. And we won't smuggle controlled goods. We're, we're okay as we are. Excellency. Ooh, cleric. Right. Have another faithful experience. Small village of fundamentalist families have dug their own irrigation trench to bring fertility to otherwise barren soil. The leader explains, The old ways tell us that our creator gives us everything we need to live a comfortable life, so long as we are prepared to lift the earth and steer their rivers. We get the Edict of Cultivation. Okay. I guess we should try and bump our safety in Korith. I will up that. Don't think we need the subsidies there anymore. And conservation, we kind of still need this, so. Okay. We'll just end the turn. I don't think there's anything we really need to do. I guess we could double move people, right? We might as well double move people. The Office of Food Safety reports that recent fish stocks... Fish... Fish... There. The Office of Food Safety reports that recent fish stocks that are making their way to market have unusually high quality of microplastics. Uh, lose health or lose environment. I think we share the report. Take the environment hit. Uh, we need more diplomatic influence. You know what? I will accept this. Nutrition program. Awesome. Let's do that. Rural internet access? Probably a good idea. Yeah, I'm never going to be able to fulfill this. Uh, what do we do? Um, diplomatic influence. What are we currently on? Four. Foreign aid we can't do without a perk for that. But we could see about non-aligned and protest diplomacy. Yeah, if we flip from climate change to diplomacy, that'll help. I'm not sure it's going to be everything, but it'll help. Oh, hello. We have a new target. And unfortunately, the target is right next to Xana, which really not good. We should probably have more military units just sitting around ready for this, like a tank in each quarter of the map or something. Okay, and then let's put one tank, like, over here at the crossroad. And then the other tank over here. Faithfully, it has been assaulting tourists that are disrespecting our culture and customs. Uh, we get religious approval, conservative approval, immigrant approval goes down, relations with the U.S. goes down. Or, arrest of faith leaders, nobody assaults our tourists but me. Religious approval goes down, but we get, like, rule of law, public safety, secular approval, arrest of faith leaders. Yes. Demand for household goods. Um... I don't think we can. Like, we're not really meeting our own quota, so sorry. Wish I could say yes. Oh, great. Approval with all citizens has improved. We have Liberation Day parades. Let's get that. And 
let's get the Karu Feast as in ship roadmap going. Yeah, we're having to import. Just household goods. Did I read that wrong? Is it household appliances? We could have done that. Oh, well. Uh, processed food. What's our problem here? Um, We seem to be producing less than I'd expect. Manufacturing plants. Oh, it might be corruption. So we haven't actually dealt with corruption yet, but we need a facilities inspector for that. And the facilities inspector basically decreases corruption, which increases over time. And yeah, like 30% corruption here means we're losing a load of goods. So yes. get you down here. Surveyor. One month until available. So next month we can find an extra deposit, which I think is kind of important. Collecting this with a scholar to discuss inconsistencies within the pillars of the old ways. The scholar thinks about this for a second. Many fear that if we embrace liberalism and the liberty that comes with it, then we would excuse ourselves from moral, uh, religious morality itself. You will effectively abandon your belief. Uh, we get the Edict of Liberalism. Okay. I mean, we could import TV dinners from someone. It's like a temporary thing. You want us to improve our rule of law. Okay. You said combating corruption. And I was like, ooh, corruption. We're about to reduce that, but no. Uh, also, I heard the sound of a military unit. Oh, do we need the intel officer there to, like, spy the camp because it's invisible or something? Damn. Okay, well, let's get you over here as soon as possible. Boat visits an impoverished rural hamlet and learns the story of Gilles Le Morad, a shepherd who happened to win a notable sum in the National Lottery. For me to win, it means so many others had to lose. It is written in the old ways that the virtue of selflessness is most tested when we have the most to lose. So I immediately knew I had to share this wealth with everyone I met. The Edict of Minimalism. Okay. Long. Just in case this is going to result in a cock up, I am going to send the Sams over here. In case there are helicopters. Yes. Okay. yes. Is that close enough? Yes. We can pop this and reduce corruption at all of these buildings. If they are hiding anything, I find it. Okay, corruption's down to zero. Yes. Uh, we'll need to go get that oil, and then we'll probably make our way over here. I go right away. And also, Surveyor. New deposit! Oh no! Well, I'm glad I sent the Sams out because we're down in a tank unit. Um, right, Intel officer. Okay, apparently it's over here. Oh, uh, we're going to need to build a road. <laughs> This is how road get built. Like the defense uh, department require a road, and that's that's it. That's how roads get built. There are the airborne. Where's our reserve tank unit? We've got one here. Again, this is going to be a double move. And do we need infantry? We do. I'm going to go full mobilization here. And surveyor. Do a survey. Oil. I was really hoping we'd have gold. Maybe uranium, but ideally gold, but sure. Uh, we're going to be bottlenecked by gold very shortly. Hi. And they destroyed our seaport.
Oil prices spike. I mean, that's kind of useful. Hello! There's the encampment. Okay, um, I'm going to say we just take this right now. We don't want to leave this just wrecked for a while. We need new Sams, but whatever. And you know what? Since oil prices have spiked, let's build an oil refinery. Done. And I guess we should, like, say, hey, anyone fancy oil? You demand oil. Hey, will you give us more stuff now? No. But potentially more consumer electronics. I'm going to take the chance, and I'm going to say, just in case we need this in the future, uh, we'll up the amount. Okay. Let's get ourselves a defense minister. No, we can't. Grab actions. Whoops. Ow. Balls. Uh... Our intelligence agency was destroyed by terrorists from the Basenji Liberation Front. Damn it. I mean, that's not the worst thing, but... Right. We have tanks on the way. Oh, they're going to take that. I'm glad I brought in infantry as well. That's a point in defense, Minister. He isn't sure what he's doing here. He was tending to his flock of sheep when he was pulled into an unmarked black limo and told that the Senji needed his assistance with a matter of ma national urgency. Oh no. Inexperienced. He should only be taken as a matter of last resort. Great. You're now in charge of defense. This is going to go perfectly. Let's go veterans benefit for the loyalty. And then let's have you back away a little bit. They're probably going to take the bauxite mine, which sucks. Meanwhile, facilities yes. inspector. And that. And head over to this smelter. Alright, let's have a religious revelation. Khalid Hassan. Sorry. Walid Hassan, a 14 year old boy with alleged miraculous healing powers, volunteering at the hospital. He's in all respects a typical teenager, but his inexplicable gift has turned him into a uh, nation of believers. Okay, we get the Edict of Conversion. Ugh. And then. Go up into the mountains. That's a proper, like, religious pilgrimage right there, going up into the mountains. Anything else? Um. Just in case, I am going to send another unit of infantry this way. Oh, great. We've got obscenity laws. Just what we want. Oh, you won't let me research that. Curfew. How about... No? Religious police. Uh, no. We could go back to travel bans instead of open borders. I think is probably going to help us with a bit of security. And there we go. A large American fast food chain is seeking permission to bring the operation to Pazenji. We gain prosperity, we lose a health. Or we gain a health and we lose an entertainment. Uh, you know what? Reject. This is a question protecting our national cuisine. Not burger for you. Right. Uh, tanks. Boom! Camp destroyed. We've got so much money. Uh, okay, what do we need? Relationship, public safety, diplomatic influence, rule of law, uh, approval in Karif. Okay. Oh, what about a stadium? People love stadiums.
And also we could do a nature preserve in Rumai. It's trash. Maybe like another agricultural field. And you don't have a road. Okay, well, whatever. I feel that now's the time to also put in some, like, road connections we've been missing for a while. If only just to make travel just a little bit easier. There we go. That should make it a lot easier to travel around. The only one that I'm thinking we might want to add also is this one up here near the facility inspector. There. All right, great. And we have museum exchanges. Gain international diplomacy from that. You know what? Join the climate accord. Zanji is in the midst of an ep obesity epidemic. What? We just refused fast food. A rapid economic growth for the past decade has uh, lifestyle changes including the consumption of Western junk food, delayed in with fat and sugar. Damn it, they must be smuggling it in. Implement a year-long national fitness program. You know what? Yes. Entertainment and healthcare. Healthcare goes to like max. Cost 50, we can afford it. Oh, we're pleased to take diplomatic like influence as seriously as we do. We sent funds. Uh, the welfare of your conservative citizens. I'll agree to it. It's unlikely to happen, though. <laughs> Probably shouldn't have done that. And we're disappointed that the relationship hasn't improved. Well, it sucks to be you. Meanwhile, I guess facilities inspector. Yes. Let's pop your ability. Cleanse all of them. I forget that we need to cleanse farms as well. Oh, really? We need more diamonds. Uh, hi. Would you be willing to send more stuff? No, no. No, okay. Um, please send diamonds. Okay, now you've got more relationship with us. Nope, okay. And since we have so much money, again, I think we'll grab two more infantry. And these can be like our rapid response force people. Okay, improve conservative approval, blah, blah, blah. Improve total approval, blah, blah, blah. And raise your rule of law reputation. It's a five at the moment. Okay, let's put a holy site down here. And what else? You know what? I know how to get conservative approval. We build a museum. Yeah, because this is a high conservative population anyway. Oh, uh, we can't remember because it's full of trash. Oh, we can build it here. Right. And then a wing of great military triumphs. And that pleases conservatives. Okay, nothing this turn. On our way. Let's fix that. All right, box up mine is ours again. I'm gonna put the infantry down here. Place to respond. Bring our tanks up to here. What does that in officer say? Ooh, okay, there is another problem. Head over here. Facilities Inspector. State Inspection. Move over there. Address the nation. Can't even talk about health. Our health is too good. Let's talk about access to... You know, let's talk about poverty. Residential. Again, nobody really cares. I guess being presidential doesn't really win you anything. 
What about congestion? Uh, it's all kind of okay. Like, there's definitely places to be improved. I guess we've got the money, so why not? Oh, I've upgraded that twice. Whoops. Uh, and we'll upgrade this around here. Okay. Um, we've still got to improve prosperity. We can do that with markets. Last but not least, uh, who else gets a market? You? You get a market. And then I guess we should... Oh! Intel costs uh, actions to use. We should do Intel at some point. Going really well. I think now is the time to work on a clandestine research site where we can do all kinds of interesting things. Uh, we've constructed the mountains. So I'm thinking next to the propaganda facility. No one will ever know. At the UN today, American diplomats are calling upon Basenji to reveal the intended purpose of what is alleged to be a massive construction project within a mountain. To date, Basenji has been coy around the subject, yielding varying explanations that range from a neutrino research lab to an extravagant water park. It's a water park. You could actually potentially get those confused because they're... A research lab for neutrinos tends to involve just a really large lake of water. Admittedly, it's very different from water park in pretty much everything else, but they both involve water. So, just saying. Uh, nuclear weapons. Cyber warfare. Your cryptocurrency acquire Chinese blueprints. Ooh. Uh, really unlikely to actually... You know what? We shouldn't have built that. There's no chance we'll actually succeed. Meanwhile, our intelligence officer is still reporting that the enemy's over there. Uh, diplomacy, let's get intel on you. You're interested in the rule of law. Okay. How unconservative of you. Pop another one. Cares about the well-being of... Everyone cares about the conservatives. God damn it. Uh, oh, power is the problem. We will need to... I should have done that. Oh, well. Next turn. Excellency, disabled essentially is facing uphill battle. Uh, in rural areas. That's fine. Offer additional set of doctors to work in rural care facilities. Certain we get rural approval, but we might lose urban approval. Alternatively, we could spend even more money and just get healthcare access even more. You know what? Done. We have a lot of money. We're disappointed. Take, take the rule of law. God damn it. Okay. I've taken your policy proposals under consideration. Found them flawed. I've instead done infrastructure renewal. Great. I mean, I'm, I don't mind it. Let's learn about the green economy. Sure. Repeal overtime laws. I, But I, I don't want to. You know what? Whistleblower hotline. Less corruption. Yeah, we're definitely getting a ping from there. Oh, crap! Uh, well, that's not good. We don't have any Sams around. Well, that's the target. Where's our nearest Sam? I don't think we have any. Well, luckily we found them early on. Sam truck, double move. Get over here fast. And don't send the tank in. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Still. Doing pretty well on the money front. Uh, I think we just have to construct more 
market for more prosperity. Like, we could do a policy change, but also... That's difficult and annoying, and people will complain because they complain about everything. Get ourselves a market. There we go. And power. Whoops. I meant to do the power plan, didn't I? Uh, so we should have done our intel building again. I don't know why I forgot. Should have really done that. You know what? Hi there. 95 for that favor. Done. Uh, power plant. We can't do a nuclear reactor without actual stuff. Um. pollution away and then can we afford our intelligence yes we can okay let's share intel have that relational friendly or like-minded nations friendly so we got some with you okay well still that's good um that now means that we can up how much we export obviously we need an action for that which we don't have but i think that's where we leave this uh we have a pretty decent setup we haven't annoyed anyone too much if we look at our demographics people really love us like a lot, 65%. Uh, illegal immigrants are 50%. They're the those are dislike us the most. Like conservatives like us at 60%. Liberals at 68. We're pretty popular. And our health and entertainment is really nice. Like you can get a really good nightlife, you know, fall over, drunk, break your arm, get into hospital and still go out and party on. And we're just really efficient like that. Um, environment, maybe not so much. Maybe, maybe that, you know, falling over, you should get, get a tetanus shot at the same time, just in case. I don't know why I'm thinking that's environment, getting tetanus, but whatever. Anyway, I've been Naturalism. This has been a sponsor video. If you have enjoyed it, please check the description. There is a link to the game on Steam. If you wish to go check that out, there is also a free demo that you can check out as well. But until next time, stay shiny.